Long lines of supporters eager to attend Hillary Clinton's first post-debate campaign stop. The crowds and the enthusiasm, something she's not seen in weeks. Did anybody see that debate last night? The Democratic presidential nominee clearly reveling in the reviews, which largely judged her to be the winner of the first presidential debate. In Raleigh, North Carolina, she sharpened her attacks on her opponent, Donald Trump. I've laid out my views on a range of national security and foreign policy issues. I've laid out my plan for defeating and destroying ISIS. And what we hear from my opponent is dangerously incoherent. Clinton also mocked Trump's claim his microphone wasn't properly functioning during their matchup. Uh, I was a little bit upset that the microphone in the room wasn't working properly. Would anybody who complains about the microphone is not having a good night. By contrast, supporters believe Clinton's campaign is now on a good path toward winning the White House. These volunteers say they turned out to help Clinton based solely on what they believed was a successful debate performance. I thought she did pretty well. Um, but yeah, definitely encouraged us to come out and volunteer today. Hopefully people in the middle will have watched the debates and will have seen that Trump isn't really sure what he thinks and what he wants to do with the country. It's a message Hillary Clinton is hoping she too can convey to voters in battleground states she'll be visiting in the coming days. She's hoping the renewed energy will provide a boost in poll numbers after weeks of declining support. Kimberly Helkett, Al Jazeera, Raleigh, North Carolina.